Last year we explored game engines, software development environments designed for people to build video games. There are hundreds out there, and companies continue to develop them year after year. However, we are now coming to the end of a console generation and developers are looking forward to the future. What tools can a new generation of game engines provide? Well, the biggest players out there, Epic Games, have the new Unreal Engine 5 scheduled for release by late 2021. It was revealed earlier this year and supports all existing and upcoming systems. Among its major features include Nanite, an engine that allows for highly detailed photographic source material to be imported into the engine. Nanite virtualized geometry technology allows Epic to take advantage of its past acquisition of Quixel, the world's largest photogrammetry library, in 2019. The goal of Unreal Engine 5 is to make it as easy as possible for developers to create complex game worlds without having to spend excessive amounts of time creating new, highly detailed assets, instead allowing software to handle many of these factors. Nanite can import a huge range of pre-existing 3D models, allowing the use of film quality assets within a live production environment. It automatically handles the level of detail of these imported objects, appropriate to the target platform and draw distance, a task that an artist would have had to perform otherwise. Lumen is another major new component, described as a fully dynamic, global illumination solution that immediately reacts to scene and light changes. The system renders diffuse into reflection with infinite bounces and indirect specular reflections in huge detailed environments at scales ranging from kilometers all the way down to millimeters. Lumen eliminates the need for artists and developers to craft a light map for a given scene but instead calculates light reflections and shadows on the fly, thus allowing for real-time behaviour of light sources. With potentially tens of billions of polygons present on a single screen at 4K resolutions, Epic also developed the Unreal Engine 5 to take advantage of upcoming high-speed storage solutions with a next-generation console that will use a mixture of RAM and custom solid-state drives. One of the goals in this next generation is to achieve photorealism, on par with anything Hollywood can produce and put it within practical reach of development teams of all sizes. Numerous teams and technologies have come together to enable this leap in quality, and we're only just starting to see these new toolkits becoming available. With all this in mind, it's an exciting time not just for gamers, but for anyone working with digital 3D modelling and interactive virtual environments. From Call of Duty to Digital Twin, the next few years are going to be extremely exciting.